Hi friends. Say hey when you're hopping on. Um, we are going to do hair and makeup today. Um, it's a really exciting day. This is my six year anniversary with Lange. Is that not crazy? Um, I did a live on Valentine's Day six years ago and um, was just praying that um, they liked me and I would get to keep doing it. And it's ended up being such a fun part of my like adult life and career. And I'm so grateful. Um, okay, so we are gonna do ballet core like makeup today, which is like really soft, a little bit of like brighten inner corner eye, um, something you could totally wear on a date night. And then we're also gonna do, uh, I've been getting a lot of questions to show this tool in real life. So I've done a couple tutorials with the Latrident before, um, but today we're going to do uh, wavy hair with the Latrident. And then I'm also going to alternate a little bit of curls with the Look Clip. So, I'm gonna do makeup first. Share this video, comment, share below. Ophir and Lunge are both gonna be on here today. We're gonna do a giveaway. Um, so, we're gonna get started. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, stop. It's a kitty cat. It's trying to knock the lights over. Um, all right, sorry. Real life. Okay, primer. Dewey primer. I have a new one, but I'm just trying to use every last drop of this one. So share, 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 comment, share it. All right. So the reason you want to use a primer is it fills in all your fine lines pores, wrinkles, and it just gives your makeup a smooth surface to sit on. It also helps your makeup to stay on all throughout the day. And when you put a primer on, your primer kind of absorbs onto your skin and then puts a layer, right? So you have like this base layer primer. Then when you put your foundation on, then you have a good surface. It's not like your foundation just absorbs. And it, if you've ever seen like an orange, I've done a demonstration before where I put primer on one side of the orange. It fills in all the little pores and then I've just done foundation on the other and you can see every little pore. So it just, if you have pores, basically, you're going to love primer. Um, or maybe you don't want to cover up yours and that's fine too. But I personally like it to be like a smooth finish. So what is everybody doing today? Let me know. Anybody have anything fun planned? We have gotten a stomach bug here at our house. And then um, the girls have been sick. And so we are just survival mode. That's all we're doing. All right, just looking for my foundation brush. If you could see, I had somebody one day say like, hey, I wanna see what your workspace looks like behind the scenes. I feel like if I were to show you guys, like, this is what it looks like. Not kidding. It's just stuff everywhere. Um, so if you're ever like, oh man, I wonder why she can't find it. It's because your girl is a hot mess. Um, really is, because I feel like I do videos and then I'm normally like, okay, head out the door to go do something else. Um, it really, it's just me. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just messy. Um, okay, this is at cardamom. So I'm a little tan. I used tanning drops yesterday. And so we're going to use my tan shade, which is cardamom. You just placed a launch order 15 minutes ago. What did you get? So launch has a big sale going on. Ophir also has a deal going on on their site. So I put the links in the description of the video and the most current offers will be what pops up. Um, you can save up to 50% at launch right now. I always like to stock up when their stuff is on sale. Um, several things are on sale for Ophir. So it's just good, good deals going on. 
Ooh, over your side, make sure to like, share publicly, and comment for a chance to enter our giveaway. So the links are in the description of the video and they're also pinned in the post. All right, so this is the shade uh, Cardamon. I use the shade Coriander whenever I am not as dark. But say we are faking it with a little bit of tanning drops yesterday and just gives like a little extra oomph. Um, I always feel more confident when I am tan. All right. Here we go. We're going in with Silk to do a little highlight. It is several shades lighter. Whenever you're picking out a highlight and contour, you want to go a few shades lighter for your highlight and a few shades darker for your contour. Can you hear that baby? So Beta got her first stomach bug. It's like there's nothing sadder than a little pukey baby. Um, and so it was while we were out of town and his mom was here watching her and um, felt so bad. And then talked to her yesterday and now she has it. I'm so sad. All right, just blending this out. So hopefully everybody just stays nice and healthy. I feel like we have just been sickness after sickness. Um, this 2024. We got home a few days ago. Yeah, from Hawaii. It was such a good trip. I personally like a damp beauty blender better than a dry one. Um, so if you just run it underwater, squirt, like squeeze all the excess out, um, you'll get a little more flawless look. Okay, then I'm going to go in and use setting powder from Ophir. This is in the shade medium. If you have any little fine lines, wrinkles, um, struggle with your makeup staying on all day, this is another way you can help with that. If you are somebody who's prone to getting sweaty in your T-zone, it just kind of fixes all problems. is here. Um, going in with deep bronzer um, and just gonna contour here. Victoria said, oh, your foundation is the best for my mature skin. Here's another cat. <laughs> um, can you hear him purring? He sounds like a lawnmower. Um, see if you can see him. Hey, pumpkin, do you want to come say hello? He's gotten so big. Come on, do you want to come say hi? Come on. Hi. Want to say hello to the people? All right, so um, he really is a funny cat. I think, like, we have three cats. We have one outside cat and two inside cats. The outside cat, um, she was kind of a rescue and she was not interested in hanging out with me at all for the first like year or two. Um, and now that we have the other cats, she's like decided to come inside at night when it's cold and everything. She's completely, it's crazy. All right, you've been such a good cat. Hello. Go play. Um, anyways, <laughs> just love cats. I have some videos when I was getting dental work done um, and I was, uh, they had somebody in there recording and you're kind of like out, right? So you are um, sedated. My nose ring is like all twisted. Um, you're sedated, but you don't remember, it's like that twilight sedation because it's a long uh, procedure. And so I do not remember it, but when I was going back through, they were like, you were so funny. I didn't have the inside cats at the time. And I was saying like, 
I just love cats. Do you have cats? I wish I had cats. My husband doesn't want cats. Like, that's, I'll see if I can find the video recording. Um, that was so funny. Oh, Jennifer, you have a twin cat, Milo? Okay, just blending. Um, blending it out. Okay, so now this is like a really good base. I would say this is just having a good base makeup is awesome. So have primer, foundation, did a little highlight for my sleepy eyes, and then bronzer. If you're like, I don't know where to start. I want to try something. I want to give it a go. Like, I don't, what should I start with? I always say like, start with their foundation, seriously, um, like primer foundation, and then build from there. Because if you have a really good primer and foundation, then you your everything else will look good. All right. Not the colors we're using today. Um, hey, pumpkin, you gotta go. You're so loud. You're so excited to live life right now, but you purr so loud. Here, I'm gonna play with this. Look, it'll roll. It's a thing of tape. It'll just roll right away. Here you go, go play with it. Just make it roll everywhere. Um, Natalie, if you're watching this, can you text Adam and have him come get pumpkin? Uh, okay, here we go. We're going in with blush. I've got apricot blush and, oh, oh well, if not, it just is what it is. And it's so funny. I want to use some guava blush. Oops looking for my options. Oh, hmm. two apricots. I know I have it somewhere. Sorry, friends. <laughs> Wanted to do like a little extra pink. Let me put this cat out, out here. Hang on. Come on, kitty cat. Oh my gosh, if you can tell how big he is, not. I bet he weighs 15 to 17 pounds. He's gigantic. Okay. Back to, back to a little more quiet. Oh, now he's going to cry. He is, so we have, we've got two kittens and the black one I particularly like really, really love. She's just so soft and, um, I want her to love on me all the time. It's like the want something you can't have. She's not interested. And then Pumpkin is wants me all the time. Um, okay, we're going in with, it's gonna be so cute. Have you seen the Ballet Core makeup looks? It's like really soft, subtle, beautiful. Um, just gonna get everything I need together for it. <laughs> she must have came, she must have told him because Adam's coming up here saying, kitty, 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 kitty. Um, yep. He is, I just can't think like when there's loud purring. It's like all I can think about is like, you're purring so loud. Um, so Adam's taking him with him and he'll be nice and happy. Uh, Adam was not a cat person and um, him and Pumpkin are like best friends. So they uh, kind of kick it and do everything together. So cute. Uh, did you guys see that Ophir launched liquid liners? Um, if you haven't seen them yet, they are fantastic. Here's a brown, but like look at how tight and precise like you can get with this liner. And everything I need. Okay, so share this um, video. Ooh, Ophir says because it's Valentine's Day, they'll be including their new makeup bag in the giveaway. You're so sweet. So sweet. Okay. Great. Found the brush. 
brush I want to use. And I'm going to line with a white liner today. Um, chalk shine. And this will open up your eyes. Um, I also felt like four chin hairs whenever... Uh, whenever I was doing the foundation. I have PCOS, so I have an excessive amount of chin hair and um, stash hair. I will shave it or have to pluck just about every day. Something I used to be really, really embarrassed about, really insecure. Um, now I guess I feel like, well, it's just hormones. I can't really control it. So, and I've just had more people be like, oh, I have that too. And I wish I had seen someone like I'd never seen other than my mom, like pluck a chin hair in a car parking lot. And I wish I had seen like an example of other people to kind of normalize. Oh, you have chin hairs too. And so I was like, well, we'll just be that. So that if somebody else cannot feel it like, as ashamed in their own skin, right? Also, it's one of those things that when you feel it, it's like, I cannot help myself. I'm like, I have to get this. It's like coarse and drives me crazy. Okay, going in with the shade Apricot. This beautiful color blush. Yay, Kimberly, you just ordered for the first time. So exciting. Okay, I'm going to use this on my eyes. So a little hack, we are going to use this in our crease on a fluffy brush. So I'm just going to go in here. I'm just going to use this as my transition color for our ballet core look. So this is really soft, subtle. This is the shade Apricot. Seriously, their blushes are amazing. Um, I love, they're very pigmented, so they go a long way. They're going to last you forever, but I absolutely love their blush colors. Now I'm going to go in with a perennial palette and this palette, it's good for if you like cool tones because it has several cool tones. If you like warm tones, um, we're actually just going to use like the really bright colors today from this palette um, for inner corner. And a little bit of gold. all over my lid here. And then I'm gonna take this really gold color. It's the one here in the middle. Um, it's like more of a shimmery champagne. I'm actually gonna press it with my finger. Have I ever done dermaplaning? Absolutely. And I use those at-home dermaplaning razors as well. But if I go get like a facial, I will get dermaplaning done. Um, I'm just too hairy to like, <laughs> I just am too hairy. I would have to do it all the time. Okay, going back in with our apricot and we're just gonna get this the way I want it. So on here, actually going to go a little higher than my lid with this light color. Just a little bit. Okay, now I'm going back in with apricot blush. It's 
just going to give you a nice ombre where one began and one ended. And then I'm going to use a tiny bit of the lightest brown in this palette for my crease. Just right here. And you can tell a difference like just by that little mark, like how this is more peachy and now we've made it a little more moody by adding a tiny, tiny bit of that brown. So I use the darkest bronzing palette from Ophir. It's the Deep Teak, I believe is the name of it. Oh, it's Sun Dial Deep and the bronzer side is Teak and the highlight is Melba Shine. Okay, now I'm gonna take the same um, light brown and it is a light, a light brown. Whenever you're using colors, um, go lighter than you think you're gonna use. So that's the light brown. On you can tell it like goes a long way. Ooh, my boy is so upset. I feel like a little sick to my stomach, friends. All right. And I'm gonna go under here with the lightest brown. And then I'm going to use the shade Chalk Shine and we're going to sharpen it because this works better sharper when it has like a little point to it. And we're going to go and do your actual tight line right here. So it's just gonna open your eyes up a little more. <laughs> Amen. No more stomach bug in Jesus' name. I know. I like feel like I'm getting. Do you know when you start getting like sweaty? I'm like, oh no. Like I just. It's. I have not had any of the like throw up stuff, so I'm so grateful. Um, but I've just felt nauseous for like a while days um they have definitely been peaky all right going in with um that same darker color i'm so sorry y'all i fucked my upper lip sweating um And then this is the Ophir Apricot. I'm going to add a little bit of that. Okay. See how that kind of, if you have smaller eyes and you're looking to make them look larger, uh, that is something you can totally do. I'm throwing this one away. I have opened up this one and it's an old <coughs> mascara and I just keep traveling the world with it. So I'm finally tossing it and look this is my good one okay so oh fierce mascara has castor oil in it and oh um no i'm not pregnant nope not here but that's what it feels like it was like you know when you're morning sick and you're just nauseous all the time that's what it feels like but definitely not i just have something going around i guess Although, funny story, at one point in my pregnancy, there were a few weeks where Adam, has this ever happened? Like, Adam had, like, morning sickness. Like, he's like, oh, I just feel so nauseous. Like, oh, I'm going to be sick. Like, um, it's really funny. Also, I just am like, okay, don't want it to spread through anybody else. Like, Lysoling everything like crazy.
What a cute, I would consider this like a fantastic date night look or an everyday. It's just, I also love multi-use products. So you could use a blush on your eyes. Um, I don't know, it's just really pretty. Yeah, but no rumor committee. We're definitely not having babies around here right now. Going in, so they have castor oil in their mascara and it'll actually lengthen and strengthen your lashes. Just hold your mouth open really weird to get these bottom. So at first you put on the white and you're like, um, I feel like a little weird. And then you put your mascara on and like a little under eye and you're like, holy cow, that just opened my eyes and it looks so clean and bright and beautiful. So I also love using the shade Chalk Shine for my lips. I mentioned on a video the other day that I was a mime in uh, like middle school, high school. And I traveled with a traveling mime group and we did like white makeup all over. And the only way you could get it off was with the big blue jars of Noxzema. And um, anytime I use like the white liner, like on my eyes or anywhere, it just reminds me of that. Um, okay, so we're gonna go in, you can use this. This is the same chalk shine that we used on our uh, little waterline here. I just go in the middle. Kind of looks silly for a second, but trust the process. Go in the middle and then I'm gonna use, let's see. We're gonna go red clay and then some gloss. Um, when you are sharpening, don't sharpen it like too long, like as long as it could go. Um, because you risk breaking it. So I just sharpen it like just midway. If you ever feel like it's not coming off the way you want it to, um, I will just take like a tissue or something and wipe off, like kind of rub over the very top um, so that, I don't know, it just works and it's like really smooth and creamy again. I know this looks ridiculous right now, but trust me, it's going to be so cute. Okay, so by putting a lighter color in the inside um, and a darker color on the outside, it just looks really pretty. And it'll give you like an ombre look. I want like pinkier though. That would work, but I want something like lighter pink. Um, either lighter pink or even clear. Trap stick. That's the great thing with gloss is you can truly change a lot of how your lips look and how your liner looks depending on um, what gloss you use. Maybe the one I want is in my purse. So 
is just like a cotton candy shade. Need to exfoliate my lips. They are dry. Okay, so it kind of just gives you a little lighter color on the inside and a little darker on the edges. And you can just play with it until you get it exactly how you want. Okay, you ready to do hair? Anybody? All right, let's do it. So let me plug everything in and try and clean up a few of these things. So all the makeup products that we used today were from Ophir um, and we are about to do our hair. I'm gonna do a hair tutorial using the La Trident. I am gonna, um, I set this up against a glass here the other day, which is a plastic bottle that totally melted the bottle. So pro tip, um, don't set your tools near other bottles of product and if that does happen just be sure you get all that off because this is going to get hot I didn't realize it until I picked it up okay so it is it does get hot um all right let me make a, a clear clear little safe zone for this tool since it is on the bigger size and since I've obviously melted a hole through something recently um we're gonna just get started. Um, I'm also going to use uh, the La Clip so that you have like a little bit of variety in your um, curl. So sometimes when I use this tool, I feel like I haven't nailed my bang section um, exactly how I want it. And one day I was like, I'm gonna do like away from my face bangs. And then I am going to add in a few curls and I'm obsessed with the look of it. So, all right, let's go. Brrr, drum roll, please. So, Launch has tons of deals going on. They are known for their amazing sales. So, if you haven't shopped it lately, that is when I like to um, stock up is when things are on sale. And then this is the little clip. It is, this is the 32 millimeter. It's like an inch and a half. And, um, got any hair in there. Uh, it's titanium. They're both titanium tools. So they're going to last. I will say on this one, this guy. Okay. So you press the power button and then you're just going to select what heat you want. Um, it goes up to 450 degrees. I crank it all the way up. And then I will use a heat shield. And then I also um, have to hold it there maybe a few seconds longer than what I thought I would. Like some of their tools, you would hold it there barely a second. And then other tools, it's like, okay, one, two, three, four. So on this one, to get it to do what I like, I hold it there a little longer than I felt like I needed to. All right, we're just going to brush our hair, get all the tangles out, and I'm going to separate this into sections. I'll show you how I do it. I'm also going to turn on the La Clip. So be sure you're sharing this video. Ophir is doing a giveaway and Launch is doing a giveaway for a La Trident. So that's this waiver tool that I'm using today. So big giveaways happening on today's video. All right, so just getting all of those little tangles out. Their bristle brushes are so good because it helps evenly distribute the oil through your hair, um, helps distribute any dry shampoo, um, any products, and it gets the tangles out. So we're going in with Rival Heat Shield. This is a heat protectant, um, but it also is a, I might need to run it under some hot water. There we go. Or just scratch it. I didn't put the cap on, so 
Whoops. Okay, this smells like watermelon gummy worms. It smells so good. It's like a nice fine mist and it helps your curls last for days. When people hug me, they're like, your hair smells so good. And it's, it's rival heat shield. It does, it smells so good. Okay, we're separating our hair into sections. I'm gonna do the bottom half first, then I'll go in and do the top half. Just found it's kind of easier to make sure I got everything um, when I'm separating my hair. Do give it enough time that my um, rival heat shield is dry. Okay, so this is the um, the trident. You know, like Ariel sad, and this gives you like beachy waves. I don't know if they thought about that whenever they made this tool, but that helps me remember the name of it. <laughs> okay. So I'm just gonna start here. I'll show you how it works. So you can either go this way or sometimes if I am doing my bangs, I do it upside down. I'm just gonna go regular. So because this is a larger tool, you can do your hair really quickly with it, which is really nice. And then I just will move it down to the next section. Kim says this is the easiest tool she's ever used. It's kind of like if you need um, curling your hair for dummies, this is what it reminds me of. It's like, okay, well, all you have to do is like continue to go down your hair. I do have extension, so I'm just gonna try and see how long I need to hold this to get it the way I want it. Once you kind of figure out, oh, that's about how long I need to hold it, then I'm going to go back up here because I don't think I held it long enough. That's the only thing I've, I've had people say like, oh, it doesn't, like I didn't get the curl. And it's like you do on this tool have to hold it a little longer. So, but I think if you know that, you're like, oh, okay. Well, I just hold it. I mean, it's not like my hair isn't smoking or anything. It's just, you just have to, in order to get it to, you just hold it a little bit longer. Uh, my hair has gotten pretty long, but I do have extensions in. So my natural hair is about here, and then I have 20 inch extensions. So, okay, I'm just gonna take a chunk, and you can kind of even like fan it out a little so that as you go down, um, it's not as thick. And then just as <gasps> launch has get yours before it's sold out. I know they just not have like a huge quantity left of this tool, but it has been such a bestseller, especially close to summer. Um, I feel like these waves are just like spectacular for the summer. Okay. Down a section. And then I just continue to like follow the same curl pattern and I'm gonna add in a few little curls as well. It gives you really, really, really pretty waves. I get compliments every time I wear my hair like this. I get asked what tool I use. Before it first came out, I was practicing with it and I would have people ask, I'm like, I can't tell you yet, I'm so sorry, but as soon as it launches, I'll let you know, so. but it's here, it's available, and it looks so cute. Okay, so I'm gonna just take a piece or two and add like a curl. All right, so while we're at it, I'm gonna just take this and um, I have a little bit of a cowlick happening, so I just go ahead and straighten that. And this is the look clip. So I'm just gonna take it and rotate towards the back of my hair and then continue to go down, rotate, down, 
rotate. Then I slide it off and I'm gonna kind of like do that with it. It makes more like a little bit of a rope there. So we're gonna add a couple of these in, not a ton, just a few. And you'll see like there's no real rhyme or reason to it. It's just gonna give you like some wave, some curl, and it just looks really pretty. Curl it all the way up and then curl it down just like that. And it just makes it like a thinner curl. Okay. Now we're gonna go back in with our waves. So on this layer, that's kind of all I'm gonna do for adding in a curl or two. Uh, also, if your hair is thick, coarse, hard to curl, kind of like mine is, um, you can al always take smaller sections and the smaller the section, the faster it's gonna curl. Um, the larger the section, the longer it takes to curl and that's for any tool. down and move right along okay what's everybody's plans for today do you have something special going on um i ordered balloons from the Dollar Tree last night and the person was like, hey, I'm here to pick up balloons. I don't know if you knew you could do this, but they will deliver balloons from Dollar Tree. So I got heart balloons and she was like, they're out of helium. Do you want me to just bring the balloons? And I was like, like empty? She's like, yeah. And I was like, well, I don't have a helium machine. That won't do me any good. And so later she came, she ended up going to another Walmart or uh, Dollar Tree in that had helium and got me balloons. So when the girls woke up, well, listen, it looked like Cupid threw up in here, but in a good way. And so, um, but I was like, what am I gonna do with no helium, helium filled balloons? All right, what do you guys think about these waves? They're different than like other things you're gonna use. It gives you a different look. It is seriously amazing. And they last like uh, also something if you're like what do I do with this you could just put a little curl in it like no big deal if you find like a little um, straight piece or anything or you could put a wave you can do whatever you want you could do only waves you could do a bunch of curls and just a few waves you can really mix this up So share this video, comment share below. They're doing a giveaway for Ophir makeup and for um, lunch. So it's a big giveaway today. Two giveaways on one live. It is, when my hair is short, it gets done so fast. I'm just gonna hold it here and then I'm gonna move down. Another thing, if you wanted some of these, but you were like, oh, I, I feel like using curling with it, um, it does make it go really fast. So I've just tried to find little hacks for my life. I have four kids. I feel like we are always running late to everything. We are always pulled in 14 different directions. And so, um, trying to find how can I do my hair pretty fast is one of my goals just in life. Okay, I'm going to add a couple of curls in here. Okay, I rotate the curls towards the back of my hair. Just 
like that. And you can do bigger, smaller, you can wrap them, twist them, like however you want. And all I'm doing is like spinning it and then it just makes it kind of small. Let me do the same thing. And then that last little piece I'm going to do with um, the waiver. The La Trident. That tool is on sale right now and so is this La Clip curling iron. If you are looking for a really good curling iron that your curls last for days, this is titanium and it is fantastic. Just rotating. Spin that all the way down. And then again, you could add a curl here or I'm going to do a wave. So if you have a friend that has um, hair, long hair, short hair, it doesn't matter. If you have a friend that you think would like this tool, tag them in the comments below. I do recommend this one for medium to longer hair uh, just because the size of it on shorter hair. I I had a hard time, like when my hair was short, um, because it is a large tool, but they have smaller waiver tools and um, those are fantastic for shorter hair. It's just, you have to open the bottom part and I feel like when you're close to your face and it's short, it's like, <laughs> you don't wanna burn yourself. Um, looking around for if I missed any pieces, doesn't look like I did. I thought I saw a straight piece earlier, but if we run across it, I'll fix it. I'm going to go ahead and spray, um, before I like go through the other one. Okay. So see, perfect example. If you run across a straight piece, right, you can either, um, use your, curling iron or you could put waves. Just, it's not hard at all. Okay, and on that one, I just left it like a bouncy curl. I'm gonna do some rope, some wave, some like bouncy, and we're just gonna have just like, just trust the messy process and it turns out so good. And I don't run my fingers through the curls or the waves until um, it's like cooled. All right, and then I'm just going to put this side of my hair up because I'm just doing it in sections. You've been wanting the three barrel thing? Yes, so this is the Latrida um, and it is the biggest of their barrels, but they have two other triple barrel tools as well. Um, if you have all of them, you can even alternate kind of how I'm doing with the curls today. You can do some big waves and some smaller ones um, with that. Okay, so for my front piece, I'm gonna go towards the back of my hair with this. like that and I'm not going to run my hands through it now I'm gonna take and start using the waiver and I'm gonna mix and match this and it's just gonna look so good who's <laughs> ready for the beach right I actually wished I had a friend who brought it with her and her hair looked so pretty. I don't know. It was one of the nights we were going to dinner and I was like, what did you use for your hair? And she's like, the Lord tried it. And I was like, I didn't bring it with me. And she was like, you can come use it if you need to, but I never made it like to her room to use it. And I was like, oh, perfect for Hawaii. Going right along.
And I am going to add a couple little curls in here in a second. So when I use this, I love the way my hair looks, but I will be honest, sometimes when you crimp the front sections, depending on how long your bangs are, sometimes I've just not been able to nail like that little front section. So this allows you to have, um, I don't know. I just like the way it looks. You guys can be the judge when we're done. Drop a heart if you like it. If you can tell the direction we're going. going to add a curl or two and then we'll crimp some more. Okay, so like right here. And when you're doing it, like when you're done, if you feel like, oh, I needed a little curl here or there, just add it. No big deal. There's like no right or wrong way to do this method. So I'm going to make smaller, twisty, and this one kind of closer to the back. Just going to do regular. New to launch, you have one tool so far. How many tools and products do you guys have? Who are our, like, no shame if you just have one, no shame if you have 10 on your wish list, um, all of it. Just wondering, like, what are your favorite things? I'm gonna set this little piece right here um, aside because I wanna do one more curl and I'm gonna crimp this. Can't wait to see this finish. Me too. Ooh, you're wanting the curling iron that spins? That's such a cool tool. We don't have any plans for Valentine's. None at all. Everybody's just been kind of sicky. We got everybody like little chocolates and stuffies. And, um, that's kind of just been, uh, and Adam and I probably won't do anything. Um, I feel like he got, he did get me flowers. Um, I feel like he is good to be kind of romantic often or to celebrate me often. And I think when you have that, um, you don't cling on to as much of like, maybe this Valentine's I'll get a gift. Like I've been in relationships in the past where it's like, maybe I'll get something like, Oh, and then you don't and then you're really sad and other people are posting on Instagram and it's just like you just I don't know it can feel like really lonely or like when I was a single mom like just a lonely season um and so oh, we don't do big valentines and but I we could but we just do we try and like celebrate each other often and I feel like that is way better than just getting something good like one time a year so he did get me flowers um I got him like a card and um you know like I don't know really what to oh I also got him a pack of hot tamales and it said like they're like candies and I was like to the hottest husband like punny huh um but that's it that's it But I think when you're not in that, you do cling on to, I hope I get something for Christmas or an anniversary or, you know, like something. And then it can be really di disappointing because like that was kind of the only time you might get something or might feel like loved or celebrated. And then when it doesn't happen, it's sad. And so it's like, okay, well, you know, this is a, I don't know, just different. So 
waves, waves, waves. Um, I am going to curl this little piece that's straight right here because I feel like it will blend some of our curls a little better to have some curlier pieces. But I think everyone deserves to be celebrated. And if you know of someone who's like a single mom or someone who maybe they don't have a relationship where they're celebrated, like sending them, like, I don't know, a $10 Starbucks gift card and saying happy Valentine's day. I'm so proud of you. You're such a good mom. Like those types of things go a really long way. Um, and I try and pick like a few friends to, I don't know, love on. Like just going in with some curls friends, just on these like little straight pieces. So I personally love Lange's Brago shampoo and conditioner. Um, it is really good for smoothing your hair and I mean, can we just take a moment for how cute this is? Okay, so what do you think about the curl? See how it just kind of like goes into the waves, but you don't have like a wonky crimp at framing your face? Do you see the vibe? of like the curl plus wave. I am here for it. So whenever you do have extensions, you want to be sure when you're doing pieces that you like take your long section with your short section and blend them that way. That way they, they match. Okay. Drop a heart if you're here for the um, wave curl. I, I don't, I've not seen other people doing this and so I don't really know the name of it. Uh, waves plus curls but it's just fantastic. I feel that way at least. <laughs> so the links are in the description to shop. This is the Lure Trident and then I use the 32 millimeter liquid. Okay, and I already had this bottom section done because it was done on the other layer. Penny, you're really sweet. I need like hype girls in my life like that. Did you read Penny's comment? She goes, sweetheart, you can rock any look. You're just that darn good. That's what we should be for other people. Like I want more pennies in my life that are just like, you have got this. And I hope you guys have pennies in your life that are like, you can wear and do anything like unstoppable. I think who we surround our with is, ourselves with is so important because they can either build us up or tear us down. You know, they can make us feel like we are crazy and incapable or we are fantastic and could conquer the world. Like it truly is so important who we have in our lives. So on this piece, you can tell it's a smaller piece and I'm not holding it long at all. Um, also, if you have thin hair, fine hair, um, a different texture of hair than what I have, then start with holding it just a little bit and then let go, see how your curl is. If it curled, then you know that's how long for your hair type you need to hold it. For mine, I have hard to curl, hard to manage hair, and so I just have to hold it a little longer. But if you have fine, thin hair that's easy to curl, then you won't have to hold as long as I do. Wait, <laughs> you wanna go curl your hair? Tag me, send me a picture if you do. 
I love seeing how you guys do your hair. If you recreate looks that I show, um, it's just like so exciting to think that you inspired somebody to get ready or sometimes you just feel like funky, right? And you're like, I just don't have it in me to, to get ready today. And then when you do, or at least I do, I always feel better, more productive. I don't feel like such of a hot mess and um, I always feel better. So if I can inspire somebody to try something new or get out of their box a little bit or um, throw some makeup on just so you feel good about you. Ooh, see people tagging friends. If you have a friend that you think might like this look, tag them in the comments below. Lange is doing a giveaway for this tool and Ophir is doing a giveaway as well today. So be sure you share, tag your friends. I have an exciting giveaway that we are doing. I ordered a Peloton and I'm so excited to try it. I've never gotten a Peloton and then I'm going to be doing a Peloton giveaway next month, um, starting in March, but I'm going to do a Peloton giveaway, um, on my Instagram and on my Facebook. So be sure you're watching for that. Uh, we are about to increase. Um, I'm so grateful for you guys and we could not do anything that we do without the support of you guys, like liking, commenting, sharing, shopping, all of it. And I think that it is really important to give back, um, to those who help, help your business grow. Right. And so, um, I was, I don't know, like scouring the web of like what would be really, really great. So we're going to do like Peloton, um, some launch tools, some trim fit, uh, just some of my like best sellers that I love. Um, and some things that I thought you guys might want. So like a handbag, like a luxury handbag. Um, and we're going to do a huge March giveaway. So be on the lookout for that. curling. So the extensions I have right now are hand tied human hair extensions and they're 20 inch. Um, and they were put in by my hairdresser. And so, but I have done clip in extensions before as well. Okay. Twisting that one. So it's a little thinner. Front piece, I already know is gonna curl back towards the back of my hair. I want it to be about right there. And I'll do waves beside it. But yeah, right now I have in hand tied and they just move them up. And I, I think I'm gonna keep the extension look for a while. I just love being able to do different hairstyles, different hair tutorials, uh, kind of like the way it looks. Um, and it's also giving my real hair time to, to grow because I was at that stage, you know, the phase where you're like, it's not short hair, but it isn't long hair. And you're kind of in that like mid hair. Eh. And so, um, this is helping me get through that mid hair phase. Wave. We're almost done. Yay, you love the rope curl. It's just really fun. So even when you're doing your hair just with a little curl and you're doing big curls, you can add in maybe four or five on this side and four or five of this side of the rope curl and it will change the look of curling your hair that way as well. It'll give you, especially if you have thinner hair and you're looking to have more volume by having uh, different size curls and texture, it will change the way that your hair looks. give you some extra volume. I really am so grateful for you guys. I always feel like Valentine's is so nostalgic for me because it really was my first viral video ever. Um, when I got started with launch, I had 1500 followers and I'd never had a viral video before. I normally had, um, I normally had maybe 30 to 100 people watching and I did a, a tutorial curling my hair with a straightener and it just like took off and I remember like halfway through the day I was at 100,000 
and by the next day it was at a million and it was just like growing and growing and um it totally changed people saw that video and they're like oh i think she's fun and they followed me and my following began to grow and i just kept with it and launch was so nice to want to keep working with me and they've been such a good partnership and so um really just grateful like grateful for opportunities like grateful that it like worked out um grateful i've gotten to meet and talk and hang out and um like f people from all over the world that my path probably would never have crossed with otherwise and f i don't know feel like maybe i can brighten someone's day or teach them something new or make them laugh or kind of if you're having a hard time you're going through can give you an escape for a minute away from something else um but really I don't know it's just been like the best experience and i always feel so grateful on valentine's and it was a lonely valentine's i'd just gone through a divorce and i was so 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 broke i just sold my kitchen table and my couch to pay my rent and um we were just like it was just really a hard hard season and um i didn't have a car at the time and i it was just it's to be honest, it really sucked. And so um, I'm just so grateful that this gave me an opportunity where I get to stay home with my kids. Like I have kids everywhere, um, but that I've gotten to I work <laughs> for sure. But I, um, I've i loved it. Like I could not have asked, like when you say like God knows the desires of your heart, like I could not have asked for a job that I would love more than getting to come on and go, like, do fun hair tutorials and looks and teach people something. Um, and it has been a really, really fun career. Like, really fun. And I, I don't know, like, if you could say, if you could do anything what, in the world, what would you do? Like, I used to nurse Lola, and I would watch, like, hair and makeup tutorials on YouTube, and I'd be like, how much fun would this be? And I am not a hairdresser. I am not a makeup artist. Um, but I do love showing, like, real life things that you can do. And um, I've just been really, really grateful. So, so grateful to launch and all of you guys who shop their products and to Ophir and I've been with Ophir for a little while now too. And I don't know, it's just, it's fun. So anytime we get the chance where we can give back uh, we started boxing up blessing boxes this week and um, things that we're going to do. Uh, there were seasons where like during that where people gave me either clothes for my kids or clothes for us or um, like for myself or <laughs> furniture decorations like that kind of thing. And so things that if I'm not using it or whatever like we want to start doing just blessing boxes so that maybe something I'm not using right now but it could bless someone else. And so, um, putting together those and do some fun giveaways and just grateful. Also, what do you guys think? Drop a heart if you're loving this curl wave, curl wave. Um, as you go through, if you see an area where you're like, uh, I think that could look better as a curl, throw a curl. If you go through and you're like, I think that definitely need to be a wave make it a wave but there isn't like a rhyme or reason that you have to do it a certain way i just like having a little bit of both in there all right so this is my wavy curly hair look using the lip clip and which is just a curling iron and using the latrinet and we're going to spray our hair with some, um, also funny story. Whenever Lange reached out to me about doing my first video with them, um, they were like, would you be interested in doing this? And at the time I had a flat iron that I had had from TJ Maxx from high school. Okay. And it literally sounded like popcorn in it. And so I was like, even if this doesn't work out, I'm so excited they were going to send me a flat iron. So I was like, I hope they like me. I was so nervous. I didn't know how to curl my hair with a flat iron. I watched like so many YouTube videos to figure it out. And I was just it was so out of my comfort zone. Um, but I was like, even if I just got 
a free flat iron out of this. Like mine is probably a fire hazard. Like it sounded like my sister and I, we would call it snap, crackle and pop. Cause it'd be like, shh, 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 shh. and so it was, I was really excited <laughs> just to have uh, a good hair tool. Um, and I still have that hair tool even now. And it's this many years later, like their tools are amazing. They last so long. They are wonderful quality. This might go down as my favorite hair look of all time. I kind of like went to curl this and I, so it's not really a curl and it's not really a wave. So we're just gonna. Hearts, hearts, hearts. If you ever used a waver and you know what I'm talking about when the bangs are just not, I don't know. That's my area where I'm like, I love it all, but I normally would wear a headband because of the bangs. Well, now we have um, like fix that problem. You wish I would share my first video. If it pops up on my timeline, I'll share it. Sometimes it'll say like your memories today. And so I'll go look. And if so, I'll let you guys see. My confidence was totally different. My demeanor, like my high. Uh, just everything, you know, was, I feel like I've grown a lot as a person and like went from feeling like I wasn't really good at anything to feeling like, oh wow, like if you consider these talents or hidden talents or whatever, it really did. It, it changed who I felt like I, you know, like having a purpose and surrounding yourself, like honestly with so many of you who are like, I love you or I, you taught me something or I don't know. It just felt like I went from not feeling like I had a lot of purpose or place in my life to like launching me a great opportunity to, um, to have a platform. Like I always will say like, I would not be where I am today if I didn't have the opportunity with them because that's how so many of you, like if you found me because of a launch video, like drop it below. I mean, that's how so many of you guys have, have found me over the years. And so, okay, doing a little satin nectar gloss just to help with my frizzies. Um, if I have marula oil up here, um, nope. nope, it's like an erase pre-cleanser. I don't have any up here right now. Um, which, how is that even possible? Oh, here we go. It's put up where it's supposed to be. Um, <laughs> so, okay. So Marula oil is a hydrating mist. It adds texture and shine without your hair getting frizzy, particularly for curly hair videos. I love using like two squirts on one side, two squirts on the other. It doesn't take much. You can see how it adds shine and body but I have hair that is prone to frizz. So the more I run my fingers through it, the frizzier my hair gets. Until I found marula oil. Um, I really do, you spray like one or two squirts here, one or two squirts here. It takes all the frizz out and it gives you some extra body. Just allows you to run your fingers through. Texture, shine, no frizz. Twa Chic Three Way Hairspray by Lange. Okay, they're gonna do the giveaway and pick a winner for a launch tool and for a um, some Ophir products. So you know, share, comment, share below, tag a friend. Um, I hope you guys have the best Valentine's Day ever. And um, yeah, so many people found because of launch. So big thank you to launch and big thank you to all of you guys. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you've got the Latrida, you should try this look. It's so, like you will feel like, oh, um, unstoppable. So, uh, everything is on sale and the links are in the description of this video. So, bye you guys. Have a good day.